the question is what becomes their next big thing and services is one piece right so the the iTunes store selling movies and then there's other hardware and and obviously cloud storage but these things are not you know huge compared to the massive money printing machine that the iPhone has been the good news is they've saved up over $200 billion, which makes them the largest hedge fund in the world. They've just got this mountain of cash, which to me means if they don't get a new product out there and it looks like the Project Titan, their car, they're not, they're backed off making their own car. Isn't that interesting? That's the latest um, rumor is that yeah. they're going to sell software, not yeah. hardware. Good luck with that. Um, and so I, I think that's... Well, even, you know, I, I'm thinking about Tesla. Of course, yeah. you know a lot about uh, Tesla, friend of Elon's. But Elon's been very clear, and, and so have people like George Hotz, you interviewed yeah. on uh, This Week in Startups, that you can't do the software and hardware separately. No. They, they're they very tightly integrated. You need the mm. data you get from the car to improve the software. Which is what Apple's done typically, right? Their whole ecosystem. So yeah. this this is a very weird, it could be, a, maybe it's misinformation, yeah. or who knows what it is. They have a thousand engineers working on the car. Um, but I think they're and they, gonna, by the way, as somebody's pointing out in the chat room, Apple's services suck. Yeah, I mean, they're, they're, it's this not is like they're not their software. strong suit. No, and hardware is so they, to take the hardware out is like, okay, what's the point of that? Like, that's what you're good at. Do you want Apple Maps to drive your car? Not exactly.